<laughs> I ain't playing. So here we are guys um this right here is actually a tank uh for like whenever the water whenever the actual tank for the house for the water is empty we come out here and use this little tank thing here um 
it's kind of like a backup. It's a pretty big lot as we walk around. Um, hi, there I go. <laughs> I was actually pointing at the regular tank at that point. Well, no, I, actually, I was actually pointing at that tank because I wasn't sure what it was at first. Um, but there is the house. It's being um, fixed at this moment. Um, painted and all that stuff and getting taken care of. It's, it hasn't been lived in in a while, which you'll find a lot of those in, um, in Arusha. That was the gate. The best part about this is you get to, um, you know, you sometimes get to pick out the paint if, you know, the house hasn't been lived in in a while. All these are um, fruit trees. There's lemons, there's um, guava, a lot of different goodies that we actually did use. Sorry about the lighting, guys. So walking around the house, he's um, getting all the cracks and fixing any structural things. Over here, back here, is actually a whole separate um, quarters. Um, it's three bedrooms for the servants. It has bathroom, sink area, shower area. We're going towards the back of the house. You see the um, this outdoor sink area um, used for washing clothes. That behind that door is actually another um, outdoor um, restroom. The outdoor restrooms are are, are um, they are actually squatter toilets, but we use that one for a washer. This your girl was not. I can't. No, sorry. Going back towards the front. I like bright colors, so I did choose some bright colors. <laughs> this is the veranda right here walking in the front door as you walk in this is the living room this is a fairly big room and um, the area where we saw that was gray that's where the dining room would be and um, I don't know if it's all around Africa or just Tanzania but they have like the sink there which is very convenient um, for washing hands washing a spoon if it falls on the floor <laughs> okay so right here is one of the bedrooms. And they're fairly decent sizes as well. Big windows. Bathroom, I believe this is the master. There's another bedroom. Yeah, this bedroom's right across from it, so this is another one of the children's rooms. The master did have a regular toilet. This is right next to it. This is the, that was the heater. And here's another um, regular toilet and that's another squatter with the, um, the stand-up shower. Mind you, this is all before we move in. And here's a little outdoor sink area. Okay, leaving there, down the hallway.
this is the kitchen and the kitchen does not come with appliances with this little peephole here you know you can pass the food <laughs> The kitchen, like I said, does not come with appliances, as is really if that's really common. Little shelves, that's where the fridge would go. And right across from the kitchen is another room. This one's a little smaller than the last other last um, two rooms in master. So this is um, what a four bedroom. And this is like a pantry. This is the pantry. And you can use it for anything else you'd like, but it's definitely the pantry with the nice window. And this is the outdoor. This trash right there. More um, greenery. And this home has not been used, you guys, for some time. Um they actually get it all fixed up and there you go and that's the um the whole outdoors and that actually right there um you was mount maru on a clear day you can see mount maru which is really beautiful Thank mm -hmm. you.